Masterpiece Hunt number nine. Here we go. We've got two packs of each set that could have a uh, invention, an invocation, or an expedition. So let's check it out. Uh, I've gotten lucky before. I'm trying to hit that lightning again. First up, Kaladesh. Some comments. A hijack. A tune with Aether. On to the uncommons. We got Shrewd Negotiation. Morbid Curiosity. Visionary Augmenter. And a Smuggler's Copter. Was once a great card. But you um, are not allowed to use it because it's banned, right? So let's uh, scan it up and see how much it costs nowadays. For two, it's an artifact vehicle that's 3-3. Three, three. It's got flying weather. Whenever Smuggler's Copter attacks or blocks, you may draw a card. If you do, discard a car. card. It costs one to crew. So let's see. $1.93. So I, I'm not clear. Is it banned in Pioneer? I think it might be at this point. So I'm not up to date on all of the rules of this game. But uh, I figure since it's not 10 bucks, it's probably still banned. Oh, I think I got a foil hour. Built to Smash. Another vehicle. A Malfunction. A Harness Lightning. A perpetual timepiece, a visionary augmenter, and Combal console of allocation. For one, a white and a black, he's a legendary human advisor. Two, three, whenever an opponent casts a non creature spell, that player loses two life and you gain two life. Yeah, probably a pretty decent commander. An Aether Theorist. Wait, hold on. Let's scan Combal. He's a buck 34. And an Aether Theorist. And nothing else. So there we go. On to Oath of the Gate Watch. War Cleric and a Crab. And a Saddleback Legac. I've always just liked saying that. Something out of Dr. Seuss. Expedition Raptor. Walker of the Wastes. Flare Drone. Malakir Soothsayer. And Oath of Jace. For three, it's a legendary enchantment. When Oath of Jace enters the battlefield, draw three cards, then discard two cards. At the beginning of your upkeep, scry X, where X is the number of planeswalkers you control. So it's good for super friends. And a full art mountain. Jace, Oath of, 47 cents. There he is. Gambit, Aeronaut, Shrieker. Settlement, Pathfinder, Submerged Boneyard, Prophet of Distortion. Oh, I got something shiny coming up. Prophet of Distortion, Step Glider, Linvala the Preserver. Nice mythic there. For six, Legendary Angel Flying. When Linvala the Preserver enters the battlefield, if an opponent has more life than you, you gain five life. When Linvala enters the battlefield, if an opponent controls more creatures than you, put a 3-3 white angel creature token with flying onto the battlefield. It's a little balance on wheels there. And we got a foil meandering river. All right, so Linvala is a buck. And a meandering river in foil and a forest in elemental. Okay, here we go. We need a big invocation here out of this Our Devastation Pack. Devastator, Survivor, Sentinel. We've got a Quarry Beetle, a Crook of Condemnation, Unraveling Mummy, and Abandoned Sarcophagus. For three, it's an artifact. You may cast non-land cards with cycling from your graveyard. If a card with cycling would be put into your graveyard from anywhere and it wasn't cycled, exile it instead. So new cycle cards coming in Arcoria. This might be seeing a little bit of play. We got another foil, just a common strategic planning. So abandoned sarcophagus, 60 cents, reprinted in Commander 2020. So no hope for it to be improving in price. Probably yeah, the original is 43 cents. There it is, so 
Another hour pack. <clears throat> a reed stalker. A hippo. Desert. Crypt of the Eternals. Farm to market. Sand Strangler. And Jeru with eyes open. He's five. A four three legendary human warrior. He's got vigilance. When Jeru with eyes open enters the battlefield, you may search your library for a planeswalker card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. If a source would deal damage to a planeswalker you control, prevent one of that damage. Just one? Just one damage? Eh. Nah. That's how it goes. Jeru is 46 cents. And one of these punch out cards, which I think those are coming back. Uh, Aether Revolt. Here we go. Looking for a fatal push out of here. And anything else that might be good. Prey upon. Watchful Automaton. Implement of Combustion. Untethered Express. Cool. Runaway Train. Felidar Guardian. Copycat. Servo Schematic. And a Life crafter, Crafter's Bestiary. Artifact for three. At the beginning of your upkeep, try one. Whenever you cast a creature spell, you may pay green if you do draw a card. And let's see how much that's worth. Two bucks. Hey, big winner there. And a servo token. All right, another Aether pack. Alley Evasion. Daring Demolition. Another watchful. Some automatons there. Gifted Aetherborn. I'm actually going to scan this one. It's a pretty good uncommon. Buck 95. Uh, airdrop Aeronauts, right? Oh, can we see? Perilous Predicament and a Disallow. It's a decent rare. So for one and two blue, it's an instant counter target spell, activated ability, or triggered ability. Get out with your spell. Five bucks. That's our best card we've found today. Battle for Zendikar. Coming right up. Maybe. There we go. So I've already found in a um, expedition out of this box that these came from. So I don't imagine I'll be finding another one. But uh, let's see what else we can get. Tunneling Geopede. Transgress the Mind, Titan's Presence, and Ugin's Insight. For five, it's a sorcery. Scry X, where X is the highest converted mana cost among permanents you control, then draw three cards. 29 cents. Nothing big there. All right, moving right along. Call the Scions. Voracious no. Outnumber other stuff. Serene Steward, Royal Spout, Encircling Fisher, and Shrine of the Forsaken Gods. It's a land. You can tap it to add a one colorless, or you can tap it to add two colorless. Spend this mana only to cast colorless spells. Activate this ability only if you control seven or more lands. Hmm. Well, it's good with Field of the Dead, right? Well, let's see. 51 cents is the Commander 2019 version. I'm not even gonna change it. Amiket up next. Tormenting Voice. That's me. The voices tell me to open these packs just constantly. Miasmic Mummy. Horror of the Broken Lands. Warfire Javelinier. Time to Reflect. Lay Claim. And Insult to Injury. So for three, you can cast it as a sorcery from your hand, I believe. Damage can't be prevented this turn. If it's sorcery control, it would deal damage this turn. It deals double that damage instead. And Aftermath from the Graveyard, you can cast it for... Cast Injury. For Injury, deals two damage to target creature and two damage to target player. And it is a whopping 50 cents. Okay, last pack here. Come on, big money. No whammies. Cancel. Minotaur. 
dissenter. Another dissenter. Onward to victory. Shadowstorm, Vizier, Stir of the Sands, and a Plague Belcher. Zombie Beast, 5 4 for 3. It's got Menace. When it enters the battlefield, put 2 minus 1 minus 1 counters on target creature you control. Another, another zombie you control dies. Each opponent loses 1 life. I think it's pretty decent, actually. What do I know? It's only 79 cents. So there we go. Didn't get lucky this time, but that's usually how it goes with these. So thanks for watching. Tragic MTG saying, see you later.